I met, says Stefan Abraham Bears. In Brussels, Belgium, in July 1980, during the IAEA, International Atomic Energy Agency, Conference on Controlled Thermonuclear Fusion. The MIT Plasma Fusion Center and the Bears Group were among the finest plasma research centers in the world. My office at the MIT was nice with many computers around and windows overlooking the MIT buildings. Those were the times when the computers in every corner was not a common place at universities. Only the wealthiest universities, such as the MIT, could have afforded it. I have always thought of Abraham Bears as the Arnold Sommerfeld of the American plasma physics. A number of brilliant American plasma physicists of my generation were trained in the Bear School. Vicky Y. Skopf of the MIT, when he was my guest in La Jolla in 1992, also emphasized the great importance of the Sommerfeld School for the development of quantum mechanics. Werner Heisenberg and Wolfgang Pauli were Sommerfeld's graduate students, among others. Quantum theory had many conceptual difficulties but Sommerfeld used to encourage his students to focus on formal calculations, hoping that in time the conceptual difficulties would go away. Nothing of that sort has ever happened. The Einstein-Bohr controversy in quantum mechanics had ensued, and it is a hot topic even today. The Bear School was deeply, the late 1970s, involved with the radio frequency current drive and DACA max, in the lower hybrid frequency range. I concentrated my research on electron cyclotron frequency range, which was a thoroughly new research area. Our research, Bears and Stefan, on electron cyclotron barometric DACA max plasma absorption and current drive was among the first, if not the first, in the world. For the anomalous tokamak plasma absorption and current drive in the electron cyclotron frequency range, ECFR, however, you needed powerful gyrotrons that were not available at that time. Recently, 2016. The Bears' monumental work in plasma physics and technology, entitled, Plasma Physics and Fusion Plasma Electrodynamics, has been published by the Oxford University Press, USA.